just like that. <laughs> Hi, I'm Billy Joe McAllister, and I'm here today to talk to you about something that's very dear to my heart. Melanie. You may have heard about this before, but you may have not. This is something we're going to talk to you a little bit about. Hello, my name is Stafford Skillet, and here we have a Beverly finish on this table. Uh, you can also find the Beverly um, floors and cabinets. Great there, folks. This is Jib Jab Salaman. With melamine, it's such a wonderful product, you won't be needing this here fire extinguisher. Example, you could use this metalware. Equally as effective, lower on cost, and you can store your food in it, ruin your kidneys. Have a good day. China, one of the greatest manufacturing companies in the world. They have brought us several, several, several products that we all know and love. Such as airsoft, toys, and candy. But something has happened lately with some of the Chinese manufacturing companies that make milk powder that goes into our candy. They have tainted the milk powder with melamine to trick protein tests into showing that they are full of protein and good for our body. When in fact, they will bring us nothing but bladder problems, kidney problems, and sick children. What holiday just happened? Halloween! And kids got candy from China. This is not good. And the United States, FDA, has not done a single thing about this. They haven't even told us. So next time, you have some candy from China. Think twice, because they're trying to save a buck or two by not buying healthy, protein-filled milk powder. Well, melamine has its uses. It does not belong in our food supply. Not even one part per million. Please, take action in this matter. Let the FDA know that you do not approve of tainted milk products in our food supply. You can check some of these links for more information. Thank you for watching.